Hey, Soul Gardeners, it's Julie Zipper. Are you really ready to transform the way you live your life? Well, in 40 days, we can do just that together. For more details, go to 40daymeditation.com. Hello, Ambassador Gemini, and welcome now to Monday, and thanks for logging in. Cloudy, irritable chance of major thunderstorms for the Gemini's temper tantrums, if you will. Lots going on. The moon is in Taurus for starters, so you are emotionally triggered subconsciously. With the moon in Taurus, your emotions literally are focused on what is not conscious. So early childhood patterns, past life patterns, fears, funky, weird dreams, all that stuff is being stirred. If you find yourself majorly projecting onto someone else or wanting to explode, it is likely a big pointing back to you, okay? That is you really projecting, as we say in spiritual talk, onto another. But even though you're in a, a situation to project and maybe you're focused on your past life problems or your childhood problems, that's not the culprit. The culprit is the sun. We're in chapter one of sun in Libra. Uranus is ruling the day. That means breakdown in a major way. The way I look at Uranus is the big bad wolf of the solar system. It's going to huff, it's going to puff. Anything built out of straw is going to come crashing down. In your case, this orbits around your inner child. Basically, any structure in your life that's preventing you from living in joy, preventing you from living in your heart, will likely cause friction or breakdown entirely. Could be a job, could be a relationship, could be the way you treat your body, could be anything. But if something crashes down today, bing, one of the clues is it likely was in the way of you living in joy moment to moment. And if it's your mind, that's a part two. A lot of Geminis, they don't let their minds don't let them have any joy. They think away, think away, think away. So it could be a total mental head trip as well. Whatever the case is, pay attention to the details. This week, I argue, is going to be a life-changing week. The universe is introducing the themes of Saturn and Libra. In fact, the sun will cross Saturn here in the next couple of days. It's already technically conjuncting. So it is time to take responsibility for what is preventing joy in your life and step one is take away what's preventing joy in your life. Now we do have some help with that joy. Her name is Julie Zipper. She's got a show called Meditation Vibration that's free here on Soul Garden, where she does a very beautiful guided meditation, about five minutes online, on video, focusing on the Libra vibration, which means the meditation is designed to restore peace, balance, and harmony in your soul. I recommend trying it out. Could help you. Julie is free and live everywhere Soul Garden streams. Okay, Gemini, that's all you have for today, but things will perk up here tomorrow. Your planet Mercury rules the day, which means breakthrough, understanding. All that and more in 24. Live, love, be. So God.